Yo, yo, what's up everybody? We went out card hunting and showed up early to this target way out of the area in hopes to find some prison basketball and select football. There were already some dudes there when we showed up, but I was third in line so it felt like my chances of getting something desirable were pretty strong. I've been seeing and hearing about vendors and employees backdooring all of the boxes or buying everything while nobody's around so they can resell them, but I haven't fell victim to that yet. And everybody in line said this target was good about getting everything available, so it made me feel pretty confident about waiting. When the doors opened at 8 a.m., we single file walked in a line over to the cart with all of the cards on it, and instantly we asked the worker if there was any prism, and he says that he thinks so and that there should have been. Well, long story short, after searching the cart, there was no prison basketball or select football, and I'm not accusing him of doing anything, but there was definitely something sketchy that went on. When we asked him where the prism was, he told us not to accuse his team of taking any products, so I guess there was nothing we could really do, but Donruss basketball is what we made it out with, better than nothing, but definitely a disappointment when expecting prism and select. Alrighty, and as you guys saw from that not so enjoyable card hunting side of the video, we were able to make it out of the wild with some Don Russ basketball blasters. Definitely is better than nothing. I mean, it's a blessing just to find anything nowadays, but I mean, when you're coming across shady workers at Target and shady vendors 24 7, it definitely gets exhausting. And when you have high expectations for Prism, uh, settling for Don Russ can definitely be. A little bit of a disappointment but like i said it's definitely better than nothing uh we still have before we get into opening these blasters however we still have the giveaway going on uh we're gonna do three winners of the Do nba hoops uh holiday regular nba hoops blaster and then there's gonna be three winners third winner will win uh the three rookie quarterbacks from the big three rookie quarterbacks from this class but yeah it says I don't know what it is, man. These vendors, all the workers, everyone's just doing shady stuff nowadays. And just the people, the collectors who are, you know, trying to just get what, just get their stuff. It's definitely just becoming too much work nowadays. But hopefully we can get rewarded. Hopefully these downrest blasters make it worth our while. I mean, it's definitely still a good product. I'm definitely not hating on downrest. It's... This is definitely not Prism. I mean, Prism's king for sure, but... All right, let's get into opening some Donruss. Definitely, like I said, it's still a blessing just to be able to open some, so we'll definitely open this with good spirits. All right, we got Brandon Ingram, D. Booker, um, Dante, Russell Westbrook, Chris Paul. We have a league leaders, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, Isaac Okoro, and... There we go james wiseman starting off uh on the board you get one of the top rookies all right moving on yeah it says look for there's a lot of packs in these blasters 11 packs each so not gonna waste a whole lot of time on the base cards definitely not too desirable uh we have joel Embiid, complete players skylar mays and sabin lee No top rookies, but I don't know what I don't know what these stores are gonna do to um, make it less worth it for these flippers to flip. Because man, like I said, it's just getting exhausting. For I know I'm not the only one that's exhausted from the flippers. Collectors definitely deserve to get some boxes without having to pay. Uh, whatever the blasters of prism cost three hundred dollars nowadays Montrez Harrell Jason Tatum KD Josh Jackson Jordan Clarkson we have franchise features Devontae Graham and we have I'm assuming both Mavericks rookies Tyler Bay Tyrell Terry they definitely follow each other from my experiences with Donruss they definitely pair a lot of the same rookies together like uh Anthony Edwards Obi Top and I've noticed they're together Landry Schmidt, Bogdan, but he healed. Um, another James Wiseman, Great Expectations. And Jordan Navarro and Theo Maladon. I'm assuming this pack right here will be our... I mean, this is a thicker feeling pack. Um, Alright, da-da-da. 
Patty Mills and DGR. What is that? Draymond? Draymond Green? Yeah. Draymond Green game worn. Oh, all white. So this is definitely a Warriors box. It's gotten two James Wiseman, Draymond already. Followed up by Steven Adams, Malachi Flynn, and RJ Hampton. Halfway through the box. Still haven't even gotten, I don't even think we've gotten a laser yet. So hopefully they're going to reward us. We got one back there. All right, Daniel House Jr., Drew Holiday, Spencer Dinwiddie, Clay. Um, ooh, I'll take that all day. I mean, the centering is putrid on this, but, I mean, <laughs> look at that centering. The card, like, cuts in half over here. But Luka Doncic, orange laser, I'll take that for sure. Followed by Peyton Pritchard and Tyrese Maxey. Yeah, that is a pretty looking card. Wish it was centered a little better, but I mean, it's not like I was going to be able to send it to PSA anyway. There we go. Mini boom. Orange laser Luca. Hopefully that means they're going to give us the orange laser Lamello too. <laughs> Fingers crossed. All right. Four packs to go in this blaster. We got another orange laser back there. Uh, Dylan Brooks, Christian Wood, PJ, Landry Shamet, Orange Laser, followed by Josh Green and Kyra Lewis Jr. Three packs to go. We still haven't had any booms. Still haven't had any crazy booms, at least. Keldon Johnson. Um, mm -hmm. We have a rated rookie. Devin Vassell, orange laser. There we go, my guy Poku and Isaiah Stewart. Man, I don't know what it is about the. I mean, he just looks so goofy. I mean, look at the centering on this one, too. I think that's PSA 10 centering worth boys right there. Worthy boys. Yeah, but I don't know what it is about this goofy looking dude, but he can definitely ball out, even though he looks goofy. Don't let the looks deceive you. Two packs to go in the flasher. Carmelo, KCP, da 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 da. We have rookie Tyrese Halliburton. Take that. Jalen Smith. We have Hornets rookie. Boom. There we go. That feels good. If we're not going to be able to pull him out of prism, I definitely want to be able to rack up all the Don Russ, look, uh, Don Russ, Lamelo rookies that I can because he's going to be the truth, man. He's promising for sure. Mini boom. That feels good. Centering isn't as horrible on this one as the others. So that's definitely a plus as well. It's definitely not PSA 10 worthy, but still looks good. Last pack. Still got one more to go in this blaster. I would say this first one was definitely a success. We have Miles Bridges. Kobe White. Big Cat. Colin Sexton. Josh Richardson. We have... Another laser, Marcus Smart. I am a big fan of these laser cards. Followed by Devin Vassell and Obi Toppin. So I would say that first blaster, I mean, it wasn't horrible. We definitely got some nice pulls. The the orange laser Luca and the uh, the base rookie Lamelo definitely made that blaster worth it. Now hopefully this blaster right here can reward us with a laser Lamelo. That's just been on my, it's been on my wish list. I haven't been able to pull any really big laser rookies from Donruss. All right, so we have six packs to go. I say our one of our biggest laser pulls in, is in the background over here, the Zion Williamson. But I'm pretty sure those come out as solo packs. Could be wrong, but moving on, we have Wendell Carter Jr., Jared Allen, whole bunch of base. Uh, Carl Anthony Towns, Skyler Hermes, and Saban Lee. Pretty underwhelming first pack. That's what you get 11 for. We have AD, and then the Mavericks rookies, Tyrell Terry and Tyler Bay. Come on, Panini. Get some fire. 
It's fire time. Andre Drummond, Evan Fournier, Rui, James Harden, Kemba. Franchise features. Uh, Bradley Beal, Wrong Hornets rookie, Nick Richards, followed by Trey Jones. The one, the one plus that I like about, I mean, it's a, it's a pro and a con, is that you just get a lot of packs. It definitely is, uh, I mean, it's one of my favorite things to do is just to bust packs open. So, 11 packs of Blaster, they definitely uh, get your fix in. We have... Patrick Williams, Great Expectations, Daniel Turu, and Timberwolves rookie, Jaden McDaniels. Moving along here, we got seven, seven, got seven packs to go. I'm just going to skip past the base cards. We have Damian Lillard, Franchise Features, Peyton Pritchard, and Tyrese Maxey. I like Tyrese Maxey. Anybody that went to Kentucky, I hold them to a higher standard. So, any of my Kentucky boys, I definitely rock with. All right, we have a rated rookie, Orange Laser. Kenyon Martin Jr., followed by Caleb Martin, Hornets rookie, and Precious Achua. I've seen this guy throw down some pretty crazy dunks, and he's a pretty good rebounder. So, he, I mean, he might have a shot one day. Sleeve that up. Definitely not the rookie laser you're looking for, but it's better than nothing. Alrighty, moving along. We have Troy Brown, Thomas Bryant, PJ, Lamarcus Aldridge, Great Expectations, uh, RJ Hampton, Josh Green, and Kyra Lewis Jr. So, so far, none of the big rookies out of this blaster. Still got a couple more packs to go, but it's not looking too good. I mean, we still haven't gotten our autograph yet, so who knows? We have Orange Laser, uh, Dennis Smith Jr., followed by Cole Anthony, and there he is, Tyrese Halliburton. He's definitely looking like one of the better uh, role players. Ah, he could be a star one day, but... As of right now, he's just looking as one of the better, just promising players who's just gonna be, just gonna last in the league a long time. I don't know if he's gonna be a star though, but <clears throat> it's always good pulling Tyrese. Three packs to go. Still haven't seen our auto or memorabilia card. Aaron Baines, Kyrie. We have Dirk, all time leaders, followed by. Jalen Smith, we have a Hornets rookie. There he is. Two blasters, two lamellos. The centering on this one looks damn good. So that is definitely a plus. So it looks like, I mean, it wasn't a total overall failure of a trip, but obviously still disappointed with Target. But two lamellos, it's definitely a good time. There's definitely a thicker card in that pack, so we'll save that one to the left for last. We have Danny Green, Kyle Lowry, Brandon Ingram, Jaron Jackson, Matisse Thibel, Orange Laser, Ron Pelican, uh, JJ Redick, rookies Cassius Stanley and Jamius Ramsey. So comes down to this last pack. It definitely feels thicker. So no questions on what. Yeah, you can see it's definitely a thicker card in there. All right, upside down too. AD, Malik Beasley, Dorian Finney-Smith. I always like checking the uh, initials. KGN. I mean, that's got to be Kevin Garnett, right? Kevin Garnett in the Boston Celtics jersey. Game worn. Hell yeah. There we go. Nice green patch, too. Definitely is way better than that all-white junk that they like to give us. That's definitely a plus. Hall of Famer, Kevin Garnett. Orange Laser, Draymond. Okoro, and there we go. Going out on another solid rookie, James Wiseman. All right, so let's go through all of the pulls. I mean, we'll just go through the rookies, put them all over here. Got a couple Wisemans. Um, pretty, I mean, we honestly got pretty much every rookie. Uh, we didn't get any Anthony Edwards, but 
Nice Tyrese Halliburton. We got Poku. Uh, Tyrese Maxey. Draymond. Jersey card. And then our better than average pulls. We got... There's that other James Wiseman. Nice Tyrese Halliburton. Base rookie. This... I really like this one. Luca Orange Laser. And then the two Lamellos. Well, that's going to do it for this video. If you enjoyed, please like, comment, subscribe. It definitely helps. And peace out.